Hi, my name is Grant Hobson. I've been a finance analyst for the last six years. Today I'm going to run you through some financial performance methods as well as some investment appraisal techniques. How to calculate cost of goods sold. The cost of goods sold, or COGS, is the direct cost attributable to the production of the goods sold by a company. This amount includes the cost of the materials used in creating the goods, along with any direct labour costs used to produce the good. It'll exclude indirect expenses such as distribution costs and sales costs. COGS appears on the income statement and can be deducted from revenue to calculate a company's gross margin. If we take a company that has three products, A, B and C, which sells 100 units of A, 50 units of B and 250 units of C. The raw material costs for these products, respectively, are £7, £10 and £12, which gives us a total raw material cost of £4,200 for them products. Along with this, in the period, we have production costs associated with this of £10,000, as well as labour costs of £6,000. You know, as a total cost of goods sold of £20,200. So to recap, if we take a company that has three products, A, B and C, which sells 100 units of A, 50 units of B and 250 units of C. The raw material costs for these products, respectively, are £7, £10 and £12, which gives us a total raw material cost of £4,200 for them products. Along with this, in the period, we have production costs associated with this of £10,000, as well as labour costs of £6,000. You know, as a total cost of goods sold of £20,200.